Hi! Did you just publish a blog post? Or launch the new website recently? Still can't find your pages on Google? Fret not! This is the bane of almost all websites that are new. Today, I have a few smart ways to share with you to get pages indexed on Google within a few hours, if not instantly. According to Onely, 45% of the pages on Walmart's website aren't indexed. It's even worse for dictionary.cambridge.org, which has 99.5% of pages waiting for Google's mercy. Thinking this happens only with bigger and enterprise level websites? That isn't entirely true. There exist smaller websites that go unnoticed by Google bots. For example, the site you are seeing on screen has less than 100 pages. However, Google is yet to index 13 pages despite discovering all of it. This means, Google has found the pages, possibly using the sitemap submitted in the search console, but the crawler is yet to take a look at the pages and add them to the index. If this is a publisher posting time-sensitive content, they are about to miss out a lot of initial traction. What if I told you this fate can be altered using the strategies I'm about to reveal for speeding up the crawling and indexing process? Let's dive in. Method 1. Using Sitemaps The first one is going to be the most basic one. Have a sitemap for your website and submit it in the search console. I can see the smirk in your face, but the truth is, there are still websites that don't have a sitemap, and in the worst cases, they don't even have a search console account. Sitemap is still the most effective way to get your pages indexed on Google. Using the search console you can notify Google about its existence. Method 2. Using URL Inspection Tool Google's old Search Console had a Submit URL feature. But in 2018, they removed this feature, and introduced a URL Inspection Tool. So, if you have just updated your existing content and what's Googlebot to index it faster, do this. Log in to Search Console. Paste the URL within the URL Inspection Tool, and hit Enter. Now you can see Google telling you that the page is already there in its index. However, you intend to notify it about a page change. So, hit the Request Indexing button below, and wait for a few seconds. You will soon see a notification that says the URL has been successfully added to the indexing queue. Now let's take a look at a page that you just now published. Unless your website is so popular, the page may take a while to index. You can use the same URL inspection tool to give Googlebot a heads up about the newly added page. Here is how you do it. Paste the new URL within the URL inspection tool and hit enter. Google will tell you that the page is yet to be added to the index. Now, click on the request indexing button you see below and wait till you see the success notification. Method 3. Strategic Internal Links do you know that Google has set a crawl budget for your website? Despite Googlebot visiting your website daily, there are chances that a few new pages may fail to get the much required attention due to the crawl budget limitations. So, how do you make Google's crawl budget a boon rather than a bane? It's pretty simple. Once you publish a new post, make sure it is linked from the most traffic generating posts on your website. Want to know how that logic works? Let me explain. The pages driving the highest organic traffic are getting the most attention from Google. That means the Google bot is visiting them quite often. Adding an internal link to your new article from such pages makes it super easy for Google's bot to find and index it. Create a lot of noise. Okay. This one is a bit controversial, but the truth is it has worked for us here in Stan Ventures. As soon as you hit the publish button, try to create a lot of noise around the article. Try sharing it on multiple social media platforms, including Reddit, Quora, and other relevant discussion forums that are getting massive attention from Google. When you have the URL mentioned on multiple platforms, there are higher chances of Google's bot finding it and adding it to the index. Fixing found but excluded pages Did you stumble upon an error in the search console that says URLs discovered but excluded? It's quite a common issue among websites. There could be multiple issues leading up to this error. You can check for such errors by going to the search console and clicking on the coverage report. Here you can see the list of pages that haven't been indexed due to specific issues. Fixing it can pave the way for these pages to enter Google's index. Hope this video helped you learn some handy ways to get pages indexed on Google faster. 
don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.